All right, fam, let's head into Burlington. They opened this Burlington like a few years ago over here in West Orange. Um, The moment you walk in, they got all your holiday needs, your last minute gifts. Definitely can get it here at Burlington. I love how they be having these sets together with like the slippers, the robes, the hair supplies, mask, and all of that stuff. And it was $29.99. To me, that's not bad because you get a decent amount of items um, for 30 bucks. Not bad at all. Something quick to throw under the Christmas tree. Um, so I'm here and I'm just trying to find a few items for the kids for their little, you know, stockings, stocking fillers and stuff like that. Nothing major. Um, but I am here to waste some time for one, get out. Plus my mother needs to get some stuff for her kids to, um, get out the house and just, you know, unwind. I loved all these colors on these shoes. I don't know why, but I did. They did have a lot of nice stuff going, though. Um, Let me know if you guys shop at Burlington. So, we're going to make this trip a little quick. And then we're going to head back home because the girl got some cooking to do and stuff before the kids get home. I like to have everything done before the kids get home. But it doesn't always play out like that. Um, If you guys enjoy these kind of videos and I'm sitting here just picking up stuff like I got it like that. Mm -hmm. Um, But that's so stonk. That thing stinks. Some type of stink. Um, <laughs> if you guys enjoy these type of videos, of course, all you have to do is subscribe and press the bell so you can be notified when I upload. So let's go ahead. This line was long and I got to go home. Yes, I spent almost $300. They was not done ringing up. All right. I already got powder on me and everything. I just got home. It's 12 o'clock. Keon, he up, but thankfully he's quiet for now. I got powder. I'm at the safe flower. I'm about to start cooking dinner. I got some chicken here ready to be fried. Let me show y'all real quick. Just a few pieces. And then I have some turkey wings that I'm going to fry up. I did that a few times um, in the past, but not so much so we're gonna give that a try again i have my turkey wings here i let them i did this early in the morning let this stuff marinate in the fridge before i left and now i'm gonna try to get it all fried before hugs come home from work and before the kids come from school because i like to do everything before they come in because once everybody come in y'all it'd be hectic so i'm gonna show y'all the finishing product towards the end of the video got my flour corn starch and seasonings in this bag here the thing about frying uh, turkey wings, you don't want to have all of that um, marinade all up on your turkey wing before putting it into the flour or it won't crisp up. So be careful if you plan on doing this. Make sure it's not all wet because then your turkey wing won't get crispy. Um, how you got to do it. Shake, 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 shake it. Your turkey wing won't get real crispy while you're um trying to fry that thing so clean up as we go and i'm gonna go ahead let this oil heat up and i'm gonna show you how the finishing product y'all just came from burger tent and y'all i spent 248 dollars oh my god all right so we got some oil going yes i just used this oil like the other day so i ain't gonna waste it we're gonna reuse this oil put that chicken in there flat down yes mr man it's already on one o'clock oh my god you don't want to put too many. It's going to throw off your cooking time. And then guess what? It won't be crispy. You want to have some soggy chicken. So five is enough. And this is a big pan. So. Yes.
Dirty memory, y'all. Wiggle, 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 wiggle. Get it, 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 get it. Come here. Don't tell me no. Come here. Come on. Clap, clap, clap. Clap, clap, clap. He <laughs> said, stop. got from school she had a whole trip because she thought her teacher forgot to give her her bracelet back um it's no jewelry in school but i forgot to take her bracelet off of her um that zenobia had um put on her and she had stuff in her pocket uh, i don't know I, you had it maybe it's downstairs somewhere girl i don't know but yeah i feel like wrapping up my day i am I'm so tired, y'all. For real, I am. Dante home. He's right to his homework. He's gonna be home. She's about to start her homework. Now we gotta wait for Nyan. Nyan can get home the latest because he's charter. So he'll be home like around 4 o'clock. It's 3 30 right now. So he'll be home soon. I done cooked dinner. I'm gonna show y'all exactly what I cook. Mm hmm. And then we gonna end our one night. I don't feel like doing too much. I was gonna go ahead and wash Nyan from here and retwist his hair tonight. But the way I'm feeling right now, I don't know if that's going to happen. Keon, I need to go to sleep so I can go and edit a video. And not edit, I actually got to record a video. But then I said, stop, girl, for you break his code. Why you doing it? Why you doing it? <laughs> you took a nap in school today? Yeah. All right, now. She said she took a nap. I had a good dream. You had a good dream? Yes. I told me I wake up. You did? Yeah. I like to make my bed up. You did? Yes. Hopefully I make it. That's how you did? Yes. How old are you now? My How old are you now? My But how old are you? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. How old are you? Three. Three? All right. When is your birthday? September 28th. Yes. All right. Don't you want that, girl? Come on now. The games have to be good. Oh, God. My hair is. Say happy birthday to me. Happy birthday to No. You. This is a song for me. Don't sing a song for you. Yes. Say happy birthday. Happy birthday, Maya. Thank you, Mommy. You're more than welcome, sweetie. I'm Maya. Okay, you're more than welcome, Maya. <laughs> no, he didn't go to sleep. Because little Miss Sunshine over here would not let him go to sleep at all. But I'm still about to try to get this video recorded. Even with the noise in the background. Because it has to get done anyway. Alright, so the kids definitely had a lot going on this evening. Um, after we went to Burlington... Of course, you guys see me come in. I had to knock out dinner. Um, after I knocked out dinner, it was almost time to go get the kids. So we went, we got the kids. Keon was so tired. I tried to put him down for his nap, but Maya, she said she wanted to play. Nobody. 
was going to sleep. Um, <laughs> so that's exactly what happened. She had so much energy. So I decided to come downstairs. I said, Maya, let's go knock out these muffins for the week because we typically do this on Sunday. But I did not actually know. I did get a chance to do it. But the muffins that I made for Sunday, the kids did not really like because they said it had peanuts in it. But they did tear it down. Either way, they still tore it down. They just said they ain't like them like that. So we're making another another batch because it was only two left of those and they were chocolate. And these are the regular chocolate chip muffins. So the kids, they like those. So Maya over here, she doing an amazing job. Um, you know, helping me with these muffins. Sometimes when kids seem like they just have too much energy, they just want that attention. So here we are knocking it out. We're gonna make these muffins. I'm gonna show you guys how the dinner turned out and then we are gonna end it right where it is at. Like I said, if you are new here and you enjoy today's video, all you have to do is subscribe. It definitely helps us out. We are still a growing channel. Um, you know, mom life over here, we trying to just make it do what it do. We do our hauls. We're starting to do more vlogs. I'm a person, I don't really like vlogging because it takes a lot to put together. And most of the time, my background just be crazy. You know, the kids, they be doing their own things. Sometimes they just be having so much attitude. They at that age, y'all. Well, at least the two oldest are. Um, and it just be throwing off my energy. And sometimes, even though they're your kids, they can throw off your energy. And that's what be happening. But I be like, you know what? It's okay. It's okay. Because we going to get through this. And that's lately how I've been feeling. I don't mind it. I don't feed all into it or none of that. Because back in the day, me, oh, yeah. Mm -hmm. I would have been highly upset. Um, <laughs> but now, we just go ahead and try to figure it out. Um, because, honestly... Walking around with all of that bad energy and attitudes and stuff like that is not worth it because time is running so fast, you know, you kind of want to have more happy moments versus, oh my God, so aggravating, those kind of moments, you know. So we just get through it, let the little, you know, moments blow over and then boom, we back to it and it is what it is. Mom of multiple children, how y'all doing? Mm -hmm. It's a mom of five over here. For those of you who do not know, I have three biological children and two children that I did adopt still. My bloodline, y'all, so don't play. Um, yeah, my niece and nephew, I did adopt them back in 2015. But, of course, they was with me since 2000 and what was it? 13. Yeah, they was with me since 2013. Um, and we just one big happy family. That's it. 